Hello, it's Will. Welcome back. <laughs> that is the best impression that I can do with one of my favourite people on the internet who it just so happens I'm doing a collab with today. I'm so excited. As you'll have seen by the title, I'm doing a collab with Smiley Shani and we are going to create our own looks using this. The Serenity Palette by Cosmic Brushes. Just look at that packaging. I want that on my walls. What do you think? Yeah, lovely packaging. So, if you want to see what look I create and what she creates, her channel and video will be linked below. Keep watching! So, let me show you this palette. It is glorious. We have some mattes and shimmers and some multi-chromes, so look at this. Let's try and get one for the thumbnail. <laughs> what do I want to go with? Well first I'm going to go off and prime my eyes, so I'll be back now. Don't go anywhere. I'm back. So let me see, what do I want to start off with? What would you go with? I think to start do I want to go blue? Do I want to go purple? Do I want to go green? Shall we do blue? Yeah, since I'm wearing blue today, we'll do a blue eye makeup. Yeah, blue eye makeup, that's the word. So, I think I'll go into this shade called Echo. That nice sky blue colour. Or pastel blue. Mine is cat hairs. Me and Shani were both cat parents. She has her girl Rosé. I have Phoenix and Alfie. So let's just lay down some colours and see what happens. Let's bring in a little bit closer. Hmm. So I got this palette months ago actually, but I never got around to using it. It's always going out of stock. I think it's a very popular palette. And as ever, I'm late to the party, but that's alright, I'm here now. And if you can hear any noise in the background, it's just my neighbours making their weird noises as usual. See, when I look into the camera, that looks more opaque than it does when I look in the mirror. So get why do I like Shani so much? This is the bit that she's paying me to say. <laughs> I'm joking. I just love her content. She tells a story really well. And she's just so naturally funny. And whenever I get a notification saying that she's uploaded new content, I'm there right away. Because I just really like her content. I really like her. And <clears throat> she's one of my heroes actually because she works in the mental health service. She's a psychologist in real life, a therapist. And although she doesn't talk about it on her channel, which I understand, you know, you've got to have a balance. Yeah, a balance. You know, leave your work where it is. But she does. I specialise in working with queer people and people of colour and you know other marginalised people which when I hear I honestly I tear up it, I, I just do and that's enough there it's very blue in the viewfinder settled a little bit. I'm using P. Louise Base Shade 0.5 and I don't know why I said and Shani is one of the very few cisgender people who acknowledges that there was more than two genders Hmm? 
like the other day in one of her videos she said sir ma'am non-binary person i just smiled when i heard that because that's how i identify and if you're over from shani's channel hey i hope you enjoy yourself here do consider subscribing help me out <laughs> i'd love to welcome some new people here but it's not all about the numbers for me it's all about the message I want people to feel included here I want them to feel you know like they have somewhere to go when they just wanted to want to escape the world for a bit how's that looking Oof, I'm looking very weather beaten today I shall tell you why in a minute probably why my throat <clears throat> is a bit raspy Okay, what colour do I want to go into next? I think I'll go into this shade called River. Yeah. And I'll just pop that here. On the outer. But. Oh, look at this deep colour. I wonder what look Shani's gone for. Knowing Shani, it will be something. Well, it could be anything actually, because her looks are really diverse. Mmm. Will she have gone down the purple route? You need to watch a video to find out, and so will I. So I'm just dabbing that on there, and I'll blend it out with another different brush. We have had, Shani, we've had lots of conversations about makeup and things. She likes her Pat McGrath things and refer brushes. And I recently took the plunge and got an entire set of eye brushes from Refer. But I'm too scared to use them in case they stain. They're so nice, I just don't want to ruin them at all. Just like, just go for it, you're not ruined them. Is that looking bold enough? Actually, I think I'll just gra drag some of that down here. I think I'm improving. I'll let you be the, the judge of that, but be constructive, yeah. So just go, you've done that wrong. You've done that bit wrong, Will. Be kind about it, yeah? Okay, so the other side, which is always a problematic one, the left eye. <laughs> My deep set eyes. See, people that have normal eyes, you've got no idea what it's like when people have. Who did let our deep set eyes? The extra work we have to do. Because unless I've not found the right people, you know, tutorials, there's not a lot of people out there that do makeup looks that have deep set eyes. Well, certainly not colourful makeup that I prefer. Everyone's different, you know. Yeah, why am I weather beaten? I went into town today because I was going to see the place that I go to for support that would support autistic people. I'm autistic if you didn't know. And the weather was awful. Like really cold, really windy, really rainy. Is that a word? Rainy? And the bus took ages to come for getting home. And yeah, that the 
yeah, so we were, we were waiting just on the bus and went in the rain, and I wasn't impressed, so that's why I went very well the rain. But don't worry. I'm about to transform. This is so pigmented. I'll leave the link for Cosmic Brushes in the description if you want to check it out. Them out, sorry. Not affiliated. I just believe in sharing nice products. Do I even need to, t to tidy that? Okay, so for the inner, that bit, what should we go with? I'm thinking a shimmer, maybe this one. Definitely going to do that geochrome somewhere, definitely. And I think we're going with, oh, this one called Serenity, since that's the name of the palette, why not? just get a brush to do this bit. So if I don't bring it a little bit further up, when I look straight ahead and my eyes are open, you can't see it. I'm doing the same with brush on this side. <laughs> well, like, do you like? I hope you do. For this bit here. Then we'll go back into a shade called Echo. Just get a tiny little brush like this, which is P. Louise 124 brush. Brings it together nicely, I would say. IMO. I won't put any anything at all in my waterline because my eyes are very watery today. A bit sensitive. I think we're doing okay so far. So I'm gonna go off, do some base products, and I'll be back in a second. Don't go anywhere. I'm back, I think. Yes, I am. So, let me talk you through what I've got on my face. Mascara is Maybelline Sky High. Love this stuff, always use it. The concealer that I used is La Belle, but they've gone out of business, so you probably won't get anything from them. They were have a having a closing down, so but I'm not sure if they've used it yet. Now, I wanted to try this new blush, and yes, it is another Made by Mitchell product, but it's different to anything that you've ever seen, I think. So let's just get it out of the box. Look at the colour of this, and I thought it would go nicely with the blue. Look at this, look at this blush. It's purple. So yeah, we're going to try purple blush. Never seen it done before. Never tried it before. So yeah, why not? It does have... It's not a completely matte blush. It does have some flecks of shimmer in it. Let's see how it looks. It's 
It's got that really classic powdery smell, I love that. Oh yeah, and the foundation that I'm using is Danessa Myrix. Yummy Skin Blurring Balm Powder in the shade 1 with Absolite. Like that. I'll just do a swatch of it on my finger for you. Even if you're just someone that maybe likes using lavenders, thanks for that Juno Birch. I should tag her actually, because Juno Birch loves purple. If you don't know who Juno Birch is, click on her link below. Yeah, there's a swatch of it. I like that. Shall we do a bit more intense? Maybe that's a bit too intense. Yeah, it's looking slightly Noddy-esque. Yeah, I've not seen a purple blush before like that, have you? Let me know in the comments if I'm completely wrong. Now, just to finish up, I'm going to put some of this gorgeous duochrome shade. I'll bring that really close. Yeah, that's got to go somewhere. So I think I'll just do it on the brow bone. Do it. Put it. Bring it along the tail. I love that. Even if that was just sold on its own, I would buy it. And the brows they were done with Beauty Bay's Eyebrow Pencil in shade Espresso. And I think I'll just put that duochrome in the very corner. That's just a wee touch. I'll try and do a highlight with that. Why not? I'll use this little brush. See if I can do a highlight with that. Is that working? Yep, very slightly. Because what will Venus look as complete without highlight? None. Now, lip products. Now, because I don't have like a sort of mid purple, I'm gonna do this. So, using Beauty Bay's Petal lip gloss. Do that one first. It's got like a vanilla taste to it. And then we're going to use this label matte lip, matte liquid lipstick, and do like a mix, whatever you want to call it. I'll just dot that there.
so that's not quite as intense as that. But it's still purple. Because I don't have like blue, like that's, that's the colour I was looking for, blue. I'm running low on executive function today. Yeah, that's the finished look. Using the Serenity palette. Let's go on for the thumbnail. <laughs> I hate doing those poses, honestly I do. Well that's the look. Do you like? What do you think? I wish put my hair down but it needs washed and that's not till later tonight. So I would like to send a special thank you to Shani for doing this with me. Honestly, you have absolutely no idea what your support feels like from thousands of miles away across the pond. Uh, I talk, Honestly, I talk about you frequently with my friends in real life. I talk about you with my husband. You have been such a support to me and you are a joy to watch. You are a joy. Full stop. Yeah, you are always appreciated. Thank you so much for your presence and your friendship. And also thank you to you for watching. If you've enjoyed this, leave the video a like, that would be excellent. If you're new, do consider subscribing, it's absolutely free of course. And yeah, we've got a really nice community going on here. And thanks to everyone else who's already subscribed. You've no idea how much I appreciate all of you. Thanks very much for watching, keep looking after yourself, be kind to yourself and others, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! Rosé?